Hey guys, I'm Dan from the iPod Touch World. Today I've got a review on iSnapper. So as you see, this is the basic menu here. You have website, start, and watch the demo. Uh, watching the demo, that will give you a full-on commentary from one of the guys who um, helped create this application. He basically goes through exactly how to run the application and basically what the application is all about. So that demo was very helpful in my opinion. But if I go into start, you see here is the layout here. In the top right, you'll see it says templates credit. I'll click on that. And as you see, you have to purchase more templates. So as you see, a dollar nineteen for two more templates, which um, could get a little pricey if you use this application quite a lot. But then at the same time, it's a very useful application for party planning and stuff like that. So um, if you're into, I guess, socializing a lot or um, sending out invites, this is a very useful application. So as you see, you do have the templates here or different ones you can use. We'll just use a basic one like that. You then see you can change the background, so you can just have a basic one or whatever. And then you can add in um, pictures from your iPhone library there. Uh, you can then edit. There are clip art options, like you can have a balloon or whatever. Um, add all that. And then again, you can also add pictures from your library, which is awesome. You can add a caption, as you see, drag it on here and uh, you can actually customize that um, then you go to double tap it to edit and as you see there's lots of options here to edit uh, you can write whatever, you can change the color you can just customize the living crap out of it uh, you can then go into save and that is how the template would be displayed if I actually wanted to but, as you see, it looks like crap, so I'm not actually going to. And as you see, I've got no saved templates, so I can't really show you guys. But, um, as you see, it says, You're about to take two photos. Would you like to capture the image with the camera or to choose from the photo library? So, for these two slots here, you can either capture images or choose from the library. And then, when all is done, you can save, share this uh, invite or whatever it is in the end, like a brochure or whatever you've actually made this template into and then you can email it, uh, you can add it to a Facebook profile, you can sign into your profile and share it that way or you could share it via Twitter so you've got very accessible ways to kind of contact your friends which is a great thing about this application and uh, like I said it's great for party planning like if you want to make a party invite or whatever it's very customizable, like you saw, double tap, as simple as that, make it bigger, smaller, customize the text, uh, the colors, whatever. It's quite simple little application to use. A uh, very powerful little application, because you can customize, like I said, quite a lot out of it. Um, it's not completely customizable. Obviously, there are its drawbacks, like you can't customize to the extent that you can drag these boxes now and really completely customize it. But you do have quite a lot of freedom in this application, and like I said, uh, it is very useful. So it is free in the App Store at the moment. Uh, you did see you have to pay if you want more templates, but definitely go check out the free version, use your two templates, and then obviously if it's useful, definitely get some more. Uh, there will be a link in the description below to this application in the App Store. Check it out, like I said, it's free, small download, have a play around with it and uh, let me know what you think in a comment below. So thank you guys so much for watching, make sure to thumbs up, make sure to subscribe, make sure to give me some feedback, and uh, have a great day. Hope you enjoyed this application review.